Hey, single Leos, who's coming in for you? Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, welcome back, singles. Who's coming in for single Leos? Who's coming in? New love messages. Leo singles, who's coming in for single Leo? What's this? We have the Knight of Swords. We have the Two of Pentacles. And we have the Hanged Man, Piscean Energy. So someone's coming in a bit rushed or panicked here. They have something to say. They may not know how to say it. Who is this person? Okay. Could be a younger energy for some of you. Who's coming in for single Leo? What is this energy? Queen of Cups. Could be a water sign for some of you or someone who has feelings ready to date you. Three of Cups is there and the Five of Pentacles missing you. They could have missed out on an opportunity before or they could feel like you're getting away. So it's making them feel panicked. Who is this person? Show me. Could be a Taurus for some of you. Harfont is here. The Lovers could be a Gemini. Major Arcana is coming out. The Sun, <laughs> your Major Arcana, Leo. Okay, so this is a person who they feel like they may not know what to say. They may have been holding off on saying something to you and they don't want to miss this opportunity. So it's like, should I just profess all of my love to Leo? I'm not sure what I should do. Yeah. Someone feels like they're running out of time. Yeah, the five of cups is here. They're sad. Yeah, maybe they passed up the opportunity to talk to you. Page of Pentacles with the moon. They didn't ex express their deep emotions or they haven't. Someone hasn't been expressing their emotions and they're thinking about you. Okay, who is... Oh, the cards keep coming out. Two of Wands. <laughs> What is this? Leo, your energy could be a fellow Leo for some of you. Two of Wands, strength card, making a tough decision here about you. Look at that Queen of Wands. There you are, your energy. It's almost like they feel a bit intimidated. They feel a bit intimidated, kind of putting you on a pedestal here. What do they want to say? What does this person want to say to single Leo? Hermit, okay? It could be a Virgo. I've been in hermit mode thinking about this relationship with you. I want something with you. The star, you are my star. It could be an Aquarius. You are my wish. I keep, I feel like this person keeps daydreaming about like a life with you, what it would be like to be with you. Knight of Cups, let's date. There's the offer. Let's date. Yeah, Justice, it could be a Libra. They could, I'm getting this energy. I've never gotten this with the justice card, but someone could invite you. Sorry, those are sirens going off. So that could be significant right there. Someone could invite you to something very formal. It could be like a wedding or something that this person invites you to. They want to invite you somewhere, maybe somewhere where they feel like, oh, it's a social setting. It's not just one-on-one. -on -one. Like someone would feel more comfortable that way. Ten of Swords is here. Yeah. Now for others of you, someone could be telling you, hey, I'm I'm divorced now or I finally ended it with that other person. Now we can be together. I feel like someone feels more comfortable going back to that first story with you and them being in a social setting, like where other people are, are around. I feel like maybe they'll feel more victorious or they'll get a better answer from you. How is Leo feeling for singles? How is Leo feeling about this person or how will they feel about this person? The moon, okay? So you don't know just yet. Empress is here. Yeah, it's almost like you're remaining in this mode of, you know what? I'm just gonna ease up on my emotions. I'm not gonna show my emotions just yet. You're remaining as the Empress here. And six of pentacles, yeah, careful of who you give, you know, your energy to. Very careful. King of wands is at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, see, I see you thinking, like, should I even invest in this person? Am I still going to be dealing with a third party? Queen of swords, queen of pentacles. Look at that. Am I still going to be dealing with that? Five of wands, is, is it going to be an issue or a problem? Yeah, two of swords with the king of wands. <clears throat> you want to know if this person is serious about you. Yeah. Are they serious? Are they serious about 
Leo singles. Is this person serious about having something? We have the Six of Wands, Eight of Cups, Three of Wands, Page of Swords. Okay. Seven of Cups. I'm going to be honest. Let them show you. Okay? Don't take this person for their word until they show you concrete evidence that they are actually ready for a relationship. Don't just go off of what they say. Because what I see is that this person is going to come in, you know, kind of, you know, arrogant. And, you know, this in this way of like, they look good. Yeah, with the six of wands. It's almost like having you as arm candy. They get you and then they get distant. Eight of cups, three of wands. And then there's waiting here. With the page of swords, I don't see this person actually manifesting this or making it happen. It's like they they start slowing down. They start off real fast. That's how the energy of the reading started off, real fast, panicked. And then they get you and then they start questioning. Why are they questioning? Ace of Cups. Is this really love? Two of Cups. Yeah. The full energy. Should I take this leap of faith? What? <laughs> so what I see is someone who could potentially get cold feet. That's what I see. So they come in hot and heavy. All of this love energy. I want to be in a relationship. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. And then when they get you to let down your guard and actually give them a chance this person starts to second guess. That's what I'm seeing, okay? Who is this person? Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit? Who is this person? It doesn't mean that they're not right for you. It's just that this person needs to trust themselves and they need to trust their feelings for you. Who is this person? Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. Saturn, it could be a Capricorn. It could be older than you. Uranus, it could be an Aquarius for some of you. It could be a Cancer for some of you. It could be a fellow fire sign and one more. It could be a Scorpio for some of you. We do have Neptune, Pisces at the bottom of the deck. If they could say anything, what would they say? This person, feeling like the two of you are a perfect match. Hmm. And what timeline can we get? Whoa, the month of March. Okay. Could have been this month that you interacted with this person. We still have some days left in this month, so you could interact with this person this month. Thursday could be significant. February could have been significant. And two more. Tuesday and a Monday could be significant. Alrighty, single Leos, that is your energy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. Take care. Bye.